What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Whisker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. <clears throat> a dining room. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Let's just hope it's not Chris's. Got cold feet already? That's not like you. Who is it? You! Freeze! Get away from him, Jill! He's insane! What the hell? We better report this to Wesker. Wesker! Jill, help me look for him. Let's not leave this hall. Good idea. Barry. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris, and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. This mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh! I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. You'd make better use of it. Thanks. I may need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. What did I do now? Wesker! Barry! Help! Jill! You in there? Barry? Get me out of here! The door's jammed! Stand back! <clears throat> Grab my hand! <clears throat> Close one. A second late, you would have fit nicely into a sandwich. Really? Thanks. But Barry, didn't you say you were going back to the dining room to find other clues? I'm glad and all, but why are you here? I just had something I wanted to check. Anyway, we should get back to searching for Wesker and Chris. Thanks, Barry. I owe you one. Don't mention it. Barry. Jill, got any good news? Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse? No. Can't say it's much safer here either. We'd better secure our escape route first. There's gotta be a back door somewhere. All right then, let's split up again. Hey, hold on a sec. Look what I've found. What? A can of fizz. It's sure to yellow and mellow those things. It's yours. Hopefully you won't have to use it. What about you? Oh, don't worry. 
I like the buddy system we have here. I see. Thanks. I'll take it. See you later. Ciao. Jill. Barry, I didn't mean to get you that excited. Right. Anyway, you should read this. What do you make of it? Well, I guess we were right about this mansion being quite unnatural. You have a way with understatements. Where's the part that's torn off? Well, my only guess is that it was the most important part and somebody didn't want anyone to see it. Let's continue our investigation. Jill. Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You all right? What's gotten into you? I'm getting you worried, aren't I? But don't, I'm all right. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. Don't worry, I'm just going to get some fresh air. If I'm lucky, I'll get to waste some monsters along the way. What the hell is this thing? Barry! Jill! I thought it was finished. Yeah. That was close. Thanks again. Don't mention it. But what was that? What the hell's going on in this place? Barry. Something about that mansion still bothers me. But I think I'll stay here a little longer. We should split up again and investigate. All right. Jill! Barry? Thank God you're safe. You too, Jill. A noise I heard brought me down here, but... I didn't expect to find a place like this. Have any idea as to what might be at the bottom? There's only one way to find out. Is that sound? It could be a person. Jill, go check it out. We had enough surprises for one day. I'll stay here and secure our escape route in case something happens. Okay. I was worried, because I thought you were... Start talking. Calm down! I didn't want to do it! Believe me, I can explain! Don't lie to me! No 
time to talk. Jill, hand me my gun! Thanks, Jill. I don't believe that thing's really dead. Leave this place up to me and go on ahead. Okay. Jill! Barry! You could have at least waited up for me, you know? Let's go. Wesker! Thank you, Barry. Well, what do you know? Oh, don't blame Barry for everything. I hear that his better half and two lovely daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. <sighs> Wesker, you're pathetic. Well, you shouldn't worry too much, dear. You'll be free of all this anyway. Why eliminate stars? Believe it or not, that's Umbrella's intention. <laughs> you're just a slave of Umbrella. Smart girl. But I think you misunderstand me. The things you mention are nothing. I'll burn all of them along with this entire laboratory. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Barry? <laughs> you gotta love Barry. He must really be afraid of Umbrella. You and Umbrella took his family, you bastard. Oh. <sighs> Umbrella? Well, I used some carrots and sticks to cow him, but it had nothing to do with Umbrella. I just used Barry for my personal interests. Though both you and Barry seem to think I was following Umbrella's orders. What? What are you planning? I guess it's time for show and tell. It's magnificent. For the sake of this thing. You know, I hate goodbyes. <gasps> Barry! Forgive... me? No, you're not to blame. It's Umbrella and Wesker. Even if it meant my family, I couldn't bear turning my back on my friends again. Damn it! <laughs> Jill and Barry together in hell. You want a piece of me? What? Premature. No, Barry! You viral cultured freak! Barry! Barry! Uh, you're okay. Jill, sorry. That was careless of me. Wesker. He's gone. First, let's just get out of here. Wesker must have set it off. Let's hurry. Damn it! We're almost there! Jill, you just hit in contact with Brad! No! We can make it. Jill, ladies first. Friss! Would you let me have my moments too? All right. We'll rendezvous at the heliport.
Jill! You made it! You stay by the boat, little lady. I mean it. I've got some grown-up stuff to attend to, but I'll come back for you later, okay? You can't just leave me. No, 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 no. No. It's too dangerous for you to come along. I'm not gonna be any safer here. little girl on this planet that will listen to me. All right, stay close. You're with me now. Come on. What are you doing all along? Where are your parents? I don't have any parents. And I don't know why I'm here. I just am. She got you just like she got my baby. <clears throat> You're not scared of me? No. <clears throat> You're all right. So what's your name, sweetie? Natalia. Wow, what a pretty name. My name's Barry. Barry? That's right, don't wear it out. Over there, another one. How do you know? I can just sort of see them. No, you don't, young lady. It's too dangerous. Why? I'm not scared. You just let me handle this one. to smash through the gate. Just stay there. Okay. Ha! 
Who's the master of unlocking now, huh? Come on, hurry. You all right? Fine. Well, that was a really long way. That's her. That's my baby. Any luck in there, Mara? No! Piece of shit must be busted. Okay, then let's head over to the Bosic. Fucking technology. You can say that again. This was logged six months ago. Jesus, Moira. Your daughter's name is... Moira? Yeah. Why? <sighs> hey kid, you okay? Moira... She's dead. What? Moira was trying to get to that tower when I was with her. Listen, honey. I need you to take me there. Can you do that? Moira. No. I don't believe it. There's no way she's... So, did Moira drive you crazy? No. Moira was nice. <laughs> she does have a good heart. I bet she saw a little of Polly in you. That's her sister. Where'd you get that bracelet? I don't know. A woman needs it to I think. I'm not really sure anymore. A woman? The Overseer? I read the debrief about her little experiment. Just stay there. Okay. Follow me. Right! Hurry. Look. Edward Thompson. He was with TerraSave. Damn it. This is why I told her not to get involved. Just stay there. Okay. There's some over there. Find some cover. I'll pick them off before they spot us. <clears throat> Follow me! Right! <sighs> My vision's getting kinda... Fairy! There's something right there. I don't know what you're seeing, but point me at it. Stay there. Gotcha. Hover! Shoot! Here comes the rain. Are you going to be warm enough? I'll be all right. So where are your mom and dad? They died. In Terabrigia. You were there when the city went down? I'm sorry. None of this could have been easy. You're a tough girl. Thanks. It's on people like me to protect people like you from bioterrorists. 
We shouldn't have let you down. So, where'd you go? Terra say you put me in a home. A facility. I'm sorry, Natalia. I won't ask any more questions. I can't stand her. Who? The woman here with Wesker? That is Wesker. Alex Wesker. Two Weskers? You gotta be shitting me. <laughs> so you finally came. Moira, what have you done with her? She's responsible for the experiment six months ago. They called her the Overseer. She took Moira away from me. And now I'll never get... And all for fucking what? I'm sorry. 
It's okay. She said she was going to be reborn. Reborn how? With a virus? Why did she need my little girl? Doesn't make any sense. I'm sorry. I can't remember anything else. <laughs> oh, sweetie, I'm sorry. It's my problem, not yours. Just take it easy. Barry, are you okay? Yeah, I'm, uh... I was just thinking about how I used to go for walks like this with Moira and Polly. Were you a good family? <laughs> we tried to be. Moira and I fought a lot. Even after she grew up. Was it because she used bad words? <laughs> no. She just did that to take me off. I'm the one that drove us apart. I messed up real bad as a father. She and Polly were playing in the house. I forgot to lock up my guns. And Moira, she... Polly had an accident. Was it Moira's fault? No. It was mine. But I raised my voice at her and... I guess I never really got around to taking the blame. Polly survived, thank God. But not me and Moira. We started drifting apart. I think she still loved you. <laughs> I appreciate you saying that. I'll tell you this much. I couldn't save her, but I'm gonna save you. I promise I'll get you off this island. I know. Thanks, Barry. It's okay. I can walk now. All right, partner. Down you go. How are we gonna get back to the surface? Moira! Was Moira with you? Mary. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. She's... I tried to save her. I should have... Natalia, sweetie, where's Wesker? She went somewhere else. Oh, okay. Well, what matters is that you're safe. Wherever she went, 
We can still catch her. You're not hurt, are you? No, I just got the wind knocked out of me. You know where Wesker went? I think she's on the other side of the mountain. All right. Then we better double back up the cliff. That's a big sluice. They use it to control the water flow. What's that over there? That building might be a way up. Let's start heading in that direction. This must be the way into the mine. Barry, there's a facility down below. I think that's where we'll find her. Is your memory coming back? It's hard to describe. I don't remember this place, but it feels like I've been here. Well, it's okay. These things take time. Don't push yourself. Half a year of chasing scraps. I won't stop until I have all the answers. A year. Fucking technology. <laughs> Fuck it right up the ass. <laughs>
ever see this, bitch. Look, Moira, I know I should have let you have your space. It's okay. I gave you plenty of reasons to worry. You held your own out there, Moira. Of course she did. She's a fucking Burton. <laughs> anyway, let's let these guys come in and clean up. So, what are you going to do now, Barry? I'm going to go back to being a father. Excuse me! Hey, Polly, you see my jacket over there? Natalia, are you upstairs? Come on down and get ready! A cage went in search of a bird. But now, the bird is gone. The bird has changed. Hmm. 